said that one day I'm gonna make it. Any day, any time, it's me, Oboy Mosha. Welcome to the fans' opinion. Uh, my prediction of UCL round of 16, uh, the, the draw was today. Some fans are happy because their teams have drawn the easier opponents. Some teams are very kind of worried because they are not even sure whether they are going to make it. Uh, but I, I will give my predictions of the of round of 16. Uh, so the first, uh, for, oh, the, the, the draw was uh, Leipzig drew Man City, Manchester City. Uh, Club Rouge drew Benfica. Benfica was the, it's funny how Benfica was the leading team in the, it was, um, it, I don't know, I don't know how I can say, but it's funny how Benfica was leading in a pool where there was PSG and Juventus. So, Club Rouge drew Benfica, Liverpool uh, drew Real Madrid, uh, it's a revenge. It's the third time that Liverpool thinks that it's going to win against Real Madrid. It has been unsuccessful for the last two times. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then we have AC Milan versus Tottenham. Uh, Frankfurt drew Napoli. Dort uh, Borussia Dortmund drew Chelsea. Inter Milan drew Porto. And finally, PSG drew Bayern Munich. I guess that's the hardest draw. <laughs> That is one of the toughest game, but the most interesting to watch. So, my prediction will be, uh, let me start with uh, Man City versus Leipzig. Uh, it's so obvious that Man City will will go through to the quarter quarterfinals because I think they have a very good side. Uh, Haaland, Haaland, Haaland is so little this season. Uh, I call him an assassin. <laughs> I don't think, I, I, I guess Haaland is going to score. L let me also predict that Haaland might score <coughs> three goals in that in that game, home and away. Uh, Haaland might score three goals. So I'll go for Man City. Yeah, so um, Leipzig, Man City, I'll go for Man City. Then we have Club Rouge, Club Rouge and versus Benfica. I think... It's a, it's it's a, it's a, it's, an, it's 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 rather difficult to say, but I'll go for Benfica because you can imagine Benfica won a pool, was leading in a pool where we have PSG, PSG that has Neymar, Messi, and Mbappe, and Juventus. When the pool started. If I could have predicted, I could have predicted that PSG and Juventus were going were, were gonna go through. But funny how Benfica went through. So I think Benfica and Club Rouge are, are the ones that will go through to the quarter. Oh, I mean Benfica is the one that will go to the quarterfinals. Uh funny, funny how I think that this might be the year where Benfica wins the Champions League. I have that certain feeling. So I'm just saying, but I have that feeling that Benfica might even go ahead to win the Champions League. They are too good uh, and uh, we have to give credit where it's due. So Liverpool, Real Madrid, it's an interesting one. People might say it's time for revenge, but you know, Liverpool had a chance to revenge. They didn't do it. So again, I'm going to go for Real Madrid. Because Real Madrid has a very good team right now. They don't have many injuries. They have a good addition of Rudiger. Uh, Liverpool right now are struggling. Uh, they are struggling uh, since they sold uh, Sadio Mane to Bayern Munich. Uh, their midfield is not working very well. The club tactics are not working very well. I think they are also suffering from very many injuries. So I think Real Madrid and Liverpool, I'm going to go for Real Madrid. Yeah, they, they are very little, so I'll go for Real Madrid. That's my prediction. Uh, AC Milan and Tottenham. Uh, ha, ha, ha. It's, uh, 
I, I, I feel like they are more of at the same level. Uh, but I'll go for Tottenham because uh, when I watched that game of uh, AC Milan against Chelsea, I noticed that still AC Milan has so much work to do. Uh, it's It will be hard for them to win against an English side again. So I think uh, it will be Tottenham for me. Uh, Frankfurt and Napoli. Also, uh, Napoli was the leading team in their pool. Let me, let me, let me see, let me check, let me, yeah. Napoli was leading in a pool where we had Liverpool and Ajax. Liverpool and Ajax. Uh, in Frankfurt, Frankfurt was, was uh, second in a rather not serious pool where we had Tottenham, Sporting Lisbon, Marseille and, and Frankfurt themselves. So I think Napoli I'll, uh, the, I think Napoli is the team to go through to the quarterfinals. So I'll go for Napoli against Frankfurt. So Napoli are going to win this that game and go through to the quarterfinals. Borussia Dortmund, Chelsea. Okay. I'm a Chelsea fan. <laughs> but I don't want to be biased. But this is what I can say. If by January, by the time we're going to play this game, we will have Kovacic fully fit and Rhys James fully fit. Uh, who else? Who else? Uh, not play Sterling. There are very many wishes. <clears throat> okay, let me just do this. By that time, if we'll be having Rhys James fully fit and Kovacic fully fit, uh, then I think Chelsea might win the this drop. But if not, then Dortmund will win. But because I'm a Chelsea fan, and I, I have hopes and I believe in good things happening on the way. And uh, I saw another day, this James, uh, maybe he's making quick recoveries. Maybe he might even play in the World Cup. So in this, in this draw, I'll go for Chelsea. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully, you know, it's my team. I have to go for it. Uh, Inter Milan, Porto. Uh, not a very hard one, not a very hard one because Inter Milan went through when I thought it will not go through because Barcelona was very good. Barcelona made wonderful signings. I can't even... Barcelona made... There was no team that made the signings that they wanted like Barcelona did. Like you want someone, he wants to come over, he comes over. So, but Inter Milan won in the, and it was the second one in the pool, in that pool. It was a rather difficult one where there was Inter Milan, Barcelona, and Bayern Munich. So, for, for me, Inter Milan versus Porto, I'll go Inter Milan. Then, finally, PSG, Bayern Munich. Wow. I'll go for Bayern Munich. Considering Benfica, Topped the table in a pool where there was PSG. But Bayern Munich topped a table where there was Barcelona and Inter Milan. Uh, it's a rather kind of tough one. But I'd say Bayern Munich are not going to spare PSG at all, at all. But it's going to be an interesting pool. Uh, my, my, my prayers are... Because there's a likelihood that a team that might win against PSG and Bayern Munich uh, might play against Chelsea if it wins against Borussia Dortmund. So, but I'm going to go with Borussia, I mean Bayern Munich. So I, uh, my, my quarterfinals will look like this. Man City, Benfica, Real Madrid, Tottenham, Napoli, Chelsea, 
Inter Milan and Bayern Munich. That was my prediction. Any day, anytime, stay tuned on the fans' opinion. Tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe. It's me, your boy Moshe. Peace.